Hi fans of high quality Hi fans of high quality entertainment. I've never said that before. So I stumbled over the words. Tonight I am going to give you my top ten favorite Prince songs. Now I only followed his earlier career, so over the last few years I haven't really listened to too much of his music. I've heard bits and pieces of it, but uh, so this is just for me, anyway, his, his 80s music, I guess. And I did mention him last September in my 80s music video, and I remember uh, Give, uh, at telling people about the uh, guitar solo he did on While My Guitar Gently Weeps, which is on YouTube, and I, I guess now it has over 20 million views. And I've also, in the past, probably two or three times, I've uh, posted it on my Facebook page because I loved it back then and I love it now. You know, for talent, was he the greatest or what? I don't know. He was right up there. So here's my top ten. Number ten, let's pretend we're married. Number nine, and this song, just like a couple of others of his, I didn't care for at first, and then it got me hooked. And this is with, uh, is it Sheila Easton? You Got the Look. Number eight, Little Red Corvette. Number seven, let's go crazy. Number six, Sino the Times. And that's my cat. Uh, what's your favorite? Really? Number five, Raspberry Beret. Number four, 1999. Number three, When Doves Cry. Now, this would, of course, be most people's number one, and it quite easily could be my number one. But it's number two for me, Purple Rain. And honestly, when it came out, I thought it was a good song, but I never thought it was anything special until the last... I guess when he uh, performed at the Super Bowl, which, uh, you know, he'd, he'd kind of been out of the news for a bit, and then it's like, oh my God, everybody was talking about Prince at the Super Bowl, how he killed it. And that made me kind of proud of him, because I really did like him as an artist. And one other quick thing I just wanted to mention was, there was a time when, of course, he changed his name to a nun name, or... Uh, the symbol or the artist formerly known as Prince and of course everybody or a lot of people thought he was kind of weird and at that time I did too I thought he'd kind of lost it but now I understand it was a you know him fighting his uh, record company for the rights to his music or whatever and owning his own songs I don't know a lot about it yet I but I understand it a little better today And number one for me, once again, a song that I didn't like at first, Kiss. That has got to be, I mean, I love some of James Brown's music, really funky music, and, and Sly and the Family Stone. But I think the song Kiss is the ultimate funky song. And so that is my number one song. I would love your thoughts below. Just maybe not your favorite Prince songs, maybe just your general thoughts on Prince. Was he possibly the most talented artist? I mean, of course Michael Jackson was talented, but he just sang, danced. Prince sang, danced, wrote his own songs, produced his own albums, uh, played piano, drums, bass. Everything. He did everything. I'll shut up now and you can leave a comment below. Thank you for watching. Bye bye. And up very soon, rate the artist Tom Petty.
but don't mention Tom Petty in the comments section or I'll be very, very upset. Bye.